Alaska trip. We're heading to Seward to go on a uh, Resurrection Bay tour. And then Paul's going on a fishing charter. Hopefully to catch some salmon. Looks like it's cloudy today. Wish us luck. We're trying to still see Denali. We're still part of the 70%. Come on, you're gonna cross here. Okay, bye. Bye, guys. Whatever, whatever they serve us. Wait, what? Oh, we just walk in one? Yeah, we already checked in. Oh, we already checked in? Can we go? Oh, yeah, that's gonna be our thing, the Coastal Explorer. And the Cardi's. And, um, yeah. The water's so smelly. Uh -oh. Hi! Costa. Yeah. Wait, wait. Hold on. Hold Down in the middle. Guys. Of Cova to the left. There are three shirt or outline station charter. Food. Yeah, there's a long line already for bread or whatever. Dining room. It's here. Okay. Hello. Okay. It's fish. 
This is the salad. Over there is the fish. The main Can thing. I go get it? What do you have to Jake? What? So either salmon or chicken. <laughs> How's that you guys? Good? Ice cream. Just see what's here. Oh look, Kristen, what kind of bird is that? I don't know. Why is its beak like that? Hmm? Why is its beak like a... <laughs> At times they sound like African lions, and that's how they got their name, sea lion. California sea lions only bark. These guys can growl. Seafloor, they will also at times pick up a rock, swim to the surface, put the shellfish on their chest, hold the rock with their forepaw, strike it against the shellfish, crack the shell, and chow down. Otters do what that otter's doing about 90% of their life, which is lay about and groom their fur. A seagull and a black oyster catcher. A mountain goat. Hey, look, a mini. Paul caught some salmon. Someone else got these. It's a video. Good. It's flavorful.
It's 12.15 a.m. here in Anchorage. Sunset today was 11.22 p.m. And that's the end of day nine. Alaska trip. over there. Shoot. Oh wow, the water. Back here at this ship creek overlook. Nothing? No. Oh, we need masks. Do you have masks? Some adults. Oh, gee. They're setting up an army. There's salmon. There's Chinook salmon. There's coho. There's rainbow trout. Coho is silver, right? I'm not sure. fish per tank. Okay. Chinook will be in the ocean okay, for about one to six years. There's a where are you from map here. It's pretty cool. <laughs> See, it's North America. Where are you from? But what about where you're from, Dad? Where are from? Which one? Wait, how do you not know where Dad lives? Yeah, but what about Mom, Dad? Everybody's from Manila, bro. Yeah, everyone's from Manila. <laughs> this is yeah, the start of the area. That's right right now in July, they're empty. That's the one I saw last The well water is brought into the building, oxygenated, and it is heated up. Water then enters each tank with a white spray bar on the side of the tank. Look down and see that white spray bar. That bar has little holes in it. And as water goes in, it allows for a circular current to fish like living in a current. That is what they're used to. It also helps them stay physically fit in the area. So fish align with that current and are happy and swimming in it. Fish Draining poop, draining poop, scrubbing.
So in here, they're Arctic char. Oh, so the ones that we saw are about um, three to four years old. That's a trout and char life cycle. Salmon transition. So place your hand up like hearts to learn your five salmon species. Pink represents a pink salmon, ring finger is a coho. The middle finger is a chinook, the pointer finger is a sockeye, and your thumb rhymes with, rhymes with chong salmon. So if you put your thumb and pointer finger together, you get zero spots. So does the chum and sockeye? Does the anal fin have a bright white tip? Yes, it's chum. No, it's sockeye. And all of your other fish fingers have spots. The pink, the coho, and the chinook. Does the fish have a dark black mouth and gums? Yes, it's a chinook. Does the fish have over oval spots all over the entire tail? Yes, it's big salmon. No, no it's coho salmon. Rainbow trout, root stock. Ooh, there are fish in there. So these are rainbow trouts. Rainbow trouts. Wear my glasses, you can see better. Yeah, go get your fishing rod. 
No, you can't fish here. There's fish. Look, they can't see they're it. trying they're to swim upstream. They Look, they're so there. big. Can you fish here? No, you can't fish here. Seriously. <laughs> ah, no. Look at all salmon. Chinook, coho, chum, pink, and saga. Okay. So Pacific salmon are, salmon are an, anadromous. They begin their lives in fresh water and migrate to sea where they spend most of their lives feeding and growing. And then they return when they return as spawning adults to the same freshwater location where they began their lives. And when they enter the uh, fresh water they are chrome colored but it will change and then um, the bright vibrant colors you see on the salmon in the creek indicates that they are preparing to spawn they are semelparous they only spawn once and die shortly thereafter we're still here at the hatchery this is by the parking area it's the big fish so we're here at the anchorage viewpoint to see denali again Looks like there's still no Denali today. These are Laos spring rolls. How are the spring rolls? Good mom. Spicy pop, beef. What did you guys say? We got the number 31. Uh, yeah, it's combination. You want me to flavor this first? Let's see. Yeah, because you don't like spicy for some reason. How is it for? It's good, mom. Garlic? -y? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Got some garlic. Some other garlic. More chocolate. Okay, let's go in, guys. Okay. Tide. Go in, go in. Open the door. Hello. Hello. Oh no. <laughs> so much. I know. It's so pretty. Dark chocolate. Brittle fudge. Well, well, we have to get this. Chaga mushroom truffle. Ooh, I'm gonna try that. Uh, raspberry rose water. I look dark chocolate. I look below. Oh, dark chocolate. What do you have today? Uh, I forgot the name. <laughs> Cherry cordial, right? Something yeah. like that. Yeah. Something like that. So and then it's dark chocolate. No, yours is milk chocolate. Oh, oh I don't. Okay, try. It. Mm. Mm. Oh, the inside is very raspberry. Hmm. Good? Yep. Mm -hmm. Wait, once in a while, I don't think you'd like it, but. Mm. That's the rest. the rest! So, the tempering process is very meticulous in order for it to come out shiny. 5 a.m. The sunset at 11 20 p.m.
p.m. today and it's been a rainy and cloudy day so we did not get to see Denali and this is the end of our day 10 Alaska trip. So when in Alaska use fibrin syrup it's actually day 11 of our Alaska trip this is our last day. So pancakes with fibrin syrup for breakfast. So we're here at the zoo It's a seal. A red fox. Ooh, a porcupine. A Tibetan yak. Alpaca. Okay, that's the mountain goat. So there's no leopards here right now. There's no time. Wow, where's the last auto? No. The last auto black one. Oh, and there's a black over there. Look at this cute bear. So tiny and funny. because the botanical garden is closed today. Here we go, Fox and ABC Alaska. We're craving some Hawaiian food. What is this, Scottish food? What is that, TJ? Oh, oh, no. How's your food? Yeah. Person got the uh, beef barbecue. Yeah. Or got the uh, seafood platter. We're at the Anchorage Airport waiting to board. That's the end of Alaska.